we had consistent sales um, almost every day this week. Um, somebody jacked up some shipping, but I'm not naming any names there, so let's go ahead and get started. They yeah, look just like it. Yeah. <laughs> Old school, new school, need to learn up. Old school, new school, need to learn up. Old school, new school. Uh, oh, oh, Come on, you can say what's up. Father's Day edition. Put your bug in here. Say hello to the people. Hello. Bye. <laughs> right. Hey, Father's Day edition. First of all, first and foremost, happy Father's Day out there to everybody. Hope you enjoy your day. Hope you enjoyed your tie, your cologne, your um, what, what, what other crap you get to sell goodness? Um, Mugs. Mugs, yeah, and all that stuff, you know. No, we don't get no, we don't get no card, you know, made with your hand and all that stuff and all that stuff. What? You know, that y'all, y'all get the mothers and everything. But without further ado, let's get into what souls for this week. Father Son Reselling Team, um, eBay, Macari, Poshmark, Goat. And this week we have sales on all four platforms. So clap it up. <laughs> all right, so we're going to start with eBay. Um, eBay, we charge shipping on eBay, so um, you know, kind of flex the numbers a little bit. Oh, total numbers um, for this week is um, 400, actually 380 something, um, but we're gonna round it up for the video to 400. Um, so, definitely um, a good week. We had consistent sales um, almost every day this week. Um, somebody jacked up some shipping, but I'm not naming any names there, so let's go ahead and get started. It look just like it. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, hey, so first um, eBay, Nike Golf Polo, $13 plus shipping. Like I said, dime a dozen. Get them for about a buck fifty, two fifty, and like I said, just a good flip. Golf courses are open and people are golfing and they're buying the shirts, so definitely appreciate it. Next is gonna be a five nights of Freddy t-shirt, so for nine dollars plus shipping. Um, personal tee. Um, so that's one thing that all the YouTubers that talk about, you know, kind of reselling when they say start in your home, that's actually a good piece of advice. Start in your home, whatever you got laying around that you don't use anymore, start with those items and, you know, and flip those items. And you can do this, no money. If you start with your items you already have in your home, flip those and then take that capital and do some other things, you can pretty much get an entry level at, you know, I ain't gonna say zero dollars, but you can get in pretty bars of entry that are pretty low. Um, so that's what's so. Next is another personal item, um, Ralph Lauren um, cardigan sweater. So for forty dollars um, plus shipping, uh, like I said, had it. Uh, that thing probably vintage by now. <laughs> we had that thing for a long time. I'm not walking around rocking a cardigan every day. So um, yeah, it's so got rid of it, and hopefully that person um, enjoys that item. Next is gonna be an Orvis polo. So for eleven dollars plus shipping, um, Orvis um, is it, it's a good brand. Every time we get an Orvis, you know, polo sweater sweatshirt, it, it goes. So definitely look, be on the lookout for Orvis. Uh, next is gonna be two two. Uh, Tiva sandals sold for twenty five dollars plus shipping. Somebody thought that I wasn't gonna be able to get that into a um, into a padded flat rate, but that somebody was wrong. Well, so, <laughs> so that's sold for twenty five dollars plus shipping. Five dollars shipping and padded flat rate is seven dollars and fifty five cents. So out of pocket, paying about two fifty for uh, for shipping, uh, but definitely. Anything over a pound that you get in a padded flat rate, padded flat rate is your a flat is, is your friend. So we got that out and got some positive feedback on that one also. Um, used pair of sandals. Uh, I gotta read the feedback. I was wondering, but you know the Tevas are 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 a hit. <laughs> um, next is a, a Nintendo Labo. Uh, so forty dollars plus shipping. So quick story on this one. Um, our margin on this got demolished by shipping. Um, I thought when I got it, but it, you know, this is an online arbitrage. Um, it was a sale, we bought three of them, and um, this is kind of, you know, just testing out this online arbitrage kind of thing right now. We bought three of them, and this one sold $39.99 plus $5 shipping. Person bought it, it was going to Puerto Rico. I couldn't get it in any box, so I had to take one of my one of the boxes that we have, you know, for, you know, one of the boxes we have sitting around here and it ended up costing, how, how much it cost? 17, it was a lot of money. I think, I think we only netted like seven bucks on this thing. So definitely when you go and get these items, especially the bulkier items, know how you're going to ship or make sure that if you're charging shipping, you're charging the adequate, um, adequate amount or that's just going to 
pack man into your into your um into your your your, your profits there. So um, next, uh, kids polo so for nine. Um, no, kids button up so for nine dollars per shipping. Like I said, one of my kids' shirts was in the bin. Um, and like I said, we just always look at the house because you probably got something in there. You probably sitting on. 10 stacks inside your house and you don't even know it and you don't even use the things anymore you get rid of them all right so that's all our ebay sales next we're going to go to uh, macari um one sale of macari cycling jersey so we had two of these jerseys same size and they and i can understand how you made a mistake because these jerseys look pretty identical um but it got to the got to the um got to the person that bought them they sent me a message saying hey this jersey is it looks Kind of the same, but it's not the same, and um, so that's really our bad. And then they said it had a rip in it too. So, and just in order to make it right, um, I, I did have the jersey that was pictured there. So we just went and bit the bullet and 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 did the shipping and um, and sent them a new jersey out. We sent that out yesterday. So um, that's pretty understanding. I'm ready to refund them, but they still wanted the jersey. So I just went in and sent it kind of outside of the app so i just you know repackaged it said hey don't give me any ratings or anything let it just do the three-day expiration where they're gonna just give me a default rating and then um and then i sent the new one out and just sent them the new tracking number so remember i always try to stress your ratings and your your online credibility is really your your currency so you want to make sure that you know you're doing right by your customer you know so you can get that good feedback so when people have confidence in who they buying from so Hopefully, you know, that jersey gets there and a good time and, you know, they're satisfied with the jersey. I told them, just keep the other one. Um, like I said, we only get to these jerseys like a buck fifty. Hey, man, keep that other one. I'll send you out the new one. And then um, we just a learning experience for us. So that's Macari. Next, Poshmark. We had a Nike Sportswear Tech Jacket. Sweet jacket. Um, online arbitrage again. I think I bought four i bought three or four of these i was gonna keep this one i bought for myself but um i'll say hey i'm gonna put it online if it sells within uh, two weeks then it, it goes you know I, I don't love these products we don't love these products <laughs> so just got rid of that one um it was a counter offer type thing but i told him hey this thing is it the, the sticker price on there is 190 uh i think i was selling for 75 and now i think i took an offer at 60 um for that Next, um, Adidas Gazelle, and I actually got a uh, sneaker, got full axe for that. Always love a full axe price, especially on Poshmark, because you know Poshmark is going to hit you with the 20% off the top. But with that 20% comes convenience, because you can put it in any box, and you can get it out of there. So I don't have to try to stuff into a, a padded flat rate. <laughs> I can get it to an adequate box, put the sticker on there, get it to the post office, and, you know, and all that stuff on Poshmark shifts priority um, or whatnot. So that was a Poshmark sale, so definitely good week for good week for Poshmark. And then our final sale was um, on GOAT, and that was uh, Adidas Boonzits. Um, Those little green shoes, right? Yeah, Boonzits sneakers, um, and I sold for six, uh, I think sixty-five, seventy. I know we cleared 58, 58 bucks for that. So um, good thing with GOAT now, I see that there that the process is a lot faster now. I know during kind of the height of the. The, the pandemic it was taking a long time to get you know to get those sneakers um authenticated um uh, but I, i've been getting them right now um within a week so definitely shout out to goat to kind of getting back into you know getting back into the swing of things and getting us our money a little bit faster um so that's what's all for this week again happy father's day you know if you are a father that's watching this enjoy your day if you are a mother who's playing that role enjoy your day and then um you know that's really all we had if i want to keep this under 10 minutes we got one minute left you got anything for the people go subscribe to the gaming channel <laughs> uh, like i said so um like comment subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend if you got any brands out there that we should be on the lookout for let us know um we about to hit this grill have some barbecue and that's it peace say peace to the people peace <laughs> <laughs> I did it, you could do it too. You need to don't be afraid to look up in the sky.